Any baggage? No. Yeah. Police! Still gives me that rush. I think we're too different, don't you? That's what I love about you, McNally. My naive belief in humanity. Your relentless optimism. What? <laughs> Steve is upset. <laughs> he is concerned about your love life, and he would like to see you two back together. And, and he'd like the show to revolve around the love story, the, the love that you share. I was saying this morning, great TV shows are built on usually a central set of characters. You look at Grey's Anatomy, it's always about Meredith and Derek, right? So you and, and Sam are like this central character, and you guys should always right. be together no matter what. So we have Mr. Breaking Peregrine. up occasionally, but <laughs> always Smith. coming back to the main in. two characters. And then everyone else evolves around you guys, I think. All right, okay, so Mr. No Peregrine, Fred, 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 Relationships are complicated. That's true. Okay? That's we true. both have to be able to work at it. That's true. And he guys, wasn't willing to. Oh he dumped boy. me. Well... Do you guys need to... You weren't being the <laughs> best girlfriend... We'll take this. You weren't being okay. the best girlfriend okay. in the world. Oh. Come on. Oh. Come on. Oh. Oh. I'm, I'm you not better stay out of this. I'm going to that a lot of viewers will recognize you and start to, to offer, you know what you really need to do? Or you know what you really yes. need to do? Yeah. And like you're the... Like I can actually control yeah, that? Yeah, exactly. That's right. Right. Um, he has a very funny story about Jerry dying, actually, yeah. last year. Oh, yeah, people went... With, so Jerry Barber, who's one of uh, our sort of... Uh, mm -hmm. One of the regular characters, yeah. he was killed last year. For sure, yeah. And people went crazy. I couldn't show my face in public for like two weeks. One oh, night no. I was driving... Or I He's was, sensitive. I, I, I was biking down <laughs> through downtown Toronto. People were yelling at me like, how could you kill Jerry? What did you do? We oh, loved no. him. Yeah, yeah. And then they some, took it seriously. Yeah. No, I, I, I was a little scared. Somebody came into, the ho into a restaurant I was eating at. They saw me from the street, sat down at my table, and yeah. basically interviewed me for 20 minutes about why. That's Jerry hilarious. Oh, just sat down at your table yeah, with they, you? Yeah, I was eating by myself. You know oh, what? No. It, it was really intense. I'll say to the folks at home, <laughs> if you have not seen the episode, you should go watch it because it, it, you guys were brilliant. That was one of the best scenes. I, I think that was the best episode of the whole series by far. I he agree. was great in it, and the cast was really great with it. It was I agree. Wonderful. I liked where the... I know that people were upset about it, but I, I really liked where the season went after yeah. that. I like how it changed all of our lives. For sure. Now you're six months into the show when you start tonight. Yep. Uh, you're coming back from undercover mm -hmm. assignment, and uh, and now what's happening with your character? Because at last point you were you were sort of with this girl who you had killed her her brother, and as yeah. as, as you do. Yes. Uh, <laughs> uh, <laughs> that was a natural. <laughs> sure, I get it. We're pretty closer together. Uh, so yeah, so Dove, you know, he sort of tries to get his life back on track. He takes a vow of celibacy, uh, which uh, you know is part of his healing process. I guess, right. and we find him uh, right before his world gets turned upside down again. Oh, really? Mm, interesting. <laughs> In a great way, if you ask me. <laughs> we'll see. Now we need to know. So what's going well, on? What, what other surprises uh, well, can I mean, you reveal? We have two new characters that are joining us this year, so um, one of them has to do with his storyline, okay. which is uh, hysterical. I think the audience will really like it. Mm -hmm. um, and, uh, you know, well, they're both, one of them is more of a rookie, another one is, is more seasoned. Yeah. Is one of them is more involved in, in, in your, my your, relationship. Because right. there's rumors that she's going to be Sam's girlfriend, right? Is that, is that the rumor? Yeah, he's, you know, he's kind of moved on a little bit. Really? Which is he'll, he'll always have Missy, you in his Listen, it's never really, <laughs> how can it really be over? You That's know what true. I mean? There's something I, way deeper than I predict that at the end of this, you guys will be back together. I guarantee it. Something big will happen. At the end of this show, <laughs> ten years down the road, you'll be back together. I'm a, Ten years? Fifteen seasons, <laughs> not that. Oh, boy. <laughs> <laughs> that's, a good, that's a good job. He, he likes to think of himself as my spiritual advisor, so if you could have him. That's right, time. that's right. I'll help you out. I'll, no I'll lend him out. <laughs> All right, thank you. So two new characters tonight. Uh, it should be a lot of fun, and uh, yeah. it's great storytelling, and that's the most important thing. That Each each individual storyline has been well-crafted, so I think you guys do a great job. Thank you yeah. very much. Good okay. stuff. Excellent. Season four, Rookie Blue, premiering tonight right here on Global. Congratulations on success, guys. Thank you. Mark, if I leave here, I'm going to show run uh, Rookie Blue next season. <laughs> uh, great idea. It'll be my season. <laughs> <laughs> I love it. All right, beautiful. Thanks very much for coming in, you guys. Uh